make sure that the battery is charged and the power switch is in the off or left position when viewed from behind. Uh, you also want to make sure that the switch on the controller is off. That would be this black rotary knob. That is what it should look like in the off position. To turn it on, you would just press against that edge. You hear a clicking sound. The red light on top will come on. And in this recessed region, you want to continue to turn the knob counterclockwise. And when it appears again, you are in the region of controlling the vehicle lift. Counterclockwise increases the lift. Clockwise reduces it. Continue to, to, to turn it clockwise past the low region until that left edge appears again. Grab that, pull it up, it'll click off. So I'll demonstrate how simple this is. First just turn the vehicle on and then quickly turn the controller on and you want to direct the controller into the rear. Within a few seconds the green navigation light will flash to indicate a successful pairing. At that point you will have control of your direction thrusters and then the rotary knob as you turn it counterclockwise will increase the lift thruster. Have fun!